In this video, we are going to create a custom input checkbox design using CSS. Here is our checkbox markup. The input checkbox and span element for the check icon are wrapped around by the label element. This is important for our CSS targeting selector. For the checkbox label element, add position relative. Add some font styling. For the input element, we need to hide this. So set the height and width property to zero. For the span check element, set the height and width. This will be our new toggle button display. Add some spacing to the left and bottom. Now, let's add the style for the check element when the checkbox is hovered over. Hide the border. Add a background color. Next, set the style for the check element when the input element is checked. Remember, the input element is inside the label so it would work the same as clicking on the label element. Next, let's create the check symbol using the pseudo element, after. Now, let's add a stroke effect when the checkbox is on focus. I'm using the same red-orange color but with 30% opacity. Finally, let's add transition style. If you are doing it on a colored background, you would need to hide the check symbol and then display it when the element is checked. 